Previously on Pixelmon Island. Okay, I do need an RK up, so I need to be able to fly around. Whoa! Okay, yeah, I see this mountain. Okay. Don't forget to like and favorite for your chance to have your comment shown on next episode. All right, welcome back, all you good-looking gamers, to Pixelmon Island. I like that. That was pretty catchy. XRPX13, the incredibly good-looking gamer, coming at you with some more Pixelmon Island. And I don't think the chests have refilled that I already got in the last episode. If you didn't see it, we could check that one, but I'm just going to fly by it. Because I actually already know that there's no way that they refilled yet. Um, because I simply just recorded the other episode, like, not too long ago. So, basically... Where we were last episode, we were getting chests and whatnot, so what I want to do this episode is get more chests and whatnot. What are you doing, you little creep? <laughs> <laughs> um, so, Ricardo, I was just telling them about my little my mix-up with the whole rule on not being able to catch legendaries. Oops, screwed that one up. And I was just sitting here while that, that was happening. Yeah, and Ricardo was sitting there not telling me I was doing something wrong. <laughs> Thanks, Ricardo. No, they didn't know how to tell me either, so... Alright, well, excuses, excuses. I'm sorry. Otherwise I should have stopped you. I'd probably just knock you out right there. Yeah, you would have just hit me straight in the face. <laughs> Alright, well, today we're going to be looking for um, a little bit more chests. I believe that there will be some maybe over here. Uh, yeah, there we go. There's one. Um, we got Scald and, and, some, and some Ultra Balls. That's good. Oh, well, I'm trying to teach him Scald. I need to learn not to do that. I need to learn not to right-click my Pokemon every two seconds. Um, in the last episode, you guys saw... Ooh, a Mewtwo. Alright, let's gain some levels. I'm going to stop at every Mewtwo just to gain some mad levels, yo. Some mad, mad levels, yo. Alright, so let's throw out um, Aggron, Paralyze him first. And... Yeah, and then we'll try to get some levels off of him. He used Mist. What does Mist even do? I don't even know what that move does. Go Torterra. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Alright. Um, Archaeops. I don't think he has any dark moves. Okay. Yep. That's phenomenal. Alright. Um, damn it. That's my flying Pokemon, you jerk. Uh, Vaporeon. Alright. We don't want Vaporeon to die, but we need to... Um, Let's let's muddy water this guy up. Come on, Mewtwo. Get muddy, bro. Oh, there we go. Sweet. Alright, and then I'm gonna switch to my other guy. My um Oh man, I'm murking him. I might just I, just, I might just kill him. Oh crap. He's trying to confuse me. Don't you dare, Mewtwo. You cannot confuse me. I am so freaking smart, you have no idea. Alright, let's go um with Umbreon. Don't kill him. Don't kill him. Oh, it had no effect. Haha, <laughs> sucker. Has no effect on me, bro. What you think? What you think? Uh oh. Oh, okay, cool. It worked. Awesome! Mad levels, yo. Mad, mad levels, yo. Leaf Storm. Holy god, that's more powerful than Razor Leaf. Uh. Holy crap. That is ridiculous. Absolutely absurd. Okay, so that's awesome that I learned that. Except for Archaeops is, is now dead, so that's not awesome at all. Alright, so let's um let's keep on walking around. Maybe we'll find a boss or two. There's a trainer. Ooh. Oh! Boss or two! Speaking of bosses, hello, Mr. Miltank. Alright, so let's throw out Agron first. Let's gain some Oh, Miltank's are actually really tough to, to kill, so I'm gonna I gotta watch it and be careful here. Let's paralyze him. Oh, man. That's ridiculous. That actually did a ton of damage. Let's see if this does any damage to him. Alright, let's see Let's see if Leaf Storm, like, rocks his face. Not really rocks his face. Oh, that wasn't very effective on, on my Torterra. Sorry, broski. Umbreon, Vaporeon, then Machamp. Alright. Vaporeon. 
All right, we'll use Muddy Water, and then we'll try to get Machamp out here, see if we can do it. Oh, Muddy Water destroys face. Let's get Machamp out. Machamp, the champion, the full ROM king of all kings. Destroy his face. Yeah, buddy. Super effective. All right, and you are dead, my friend. Mr. Miltank, you're dead. And I gained mad XP off that. Mad levels, yo. Mad, mad levels, yo. Uh, Nest Ball, Timer Ball, Paralyze here, and Gyro Ball. I hope everyone's taking into account all the uh, different types of things that I'm getting. Um, TMs and whatnot, because I'm not. I need to. I need to prep that one before I go into battle. I might even have, like... A live stream. I might. I'm not gonna do it on camera, but I might have a live stream where I just at the very end, I like before the fight, I'll just kind of sit there and I won't level up or anything, but I'll just like get my get my guys set up that way. Um, I can talk to you guys live. We could talk about you know what to put on which Pokemon, etc., etc., etc. All right, let's go over here. I believe there's a chest somewhere over here. Don't know which tree it was in, but I know that there was chest in a tree over here. And apparently some people have found shinies too on this, even though that kind of sucks because it's not like the longest series of all time. <laughs> but still, that's pretty sweet that you find a shiny in these, uh, oh, is that a chest? Nope, that's not a chest. I need my flying Pokemon. I feel useless without it. I don't need my super rod, so I'm going to leave that. Okay, so, okay, now I know where it is. It's somewhere over here in one of these trees. So I don't know exactly where it is, but I know that it's around here somewhere in the trees, like I just said. All right, so let's go hop in the water. Ugh, this is so frustrating without my flying Pokemon alive. Archaeops, why do you die? Why, why, why do you die? All right, it's in the trees, like, somewhere around here. Um, if I pass it, I'm not going to spend too much time looking for it, just because it's, could be a difficult find. Um, I mean, oh, this might be it? Nope. I probably passed it already or something. Everyone's probably yelling at me in the comment section. Oh, here's a tree, though. Here's a big tree. There's got to be something on here, or around here, right? Can't not be a chest around here on this tree. Come here, Mr. Tree. Uh, I actually don't see anything. It's weird. It's actually real weird. Uh, yeah. Okay, so that means I'm just going to go ahead and head back to the Tiki. Um, we'll just warp there. I'm just looking if, to see if there's any bosses or anything else that I could maybe try to kill really quickly before I head over. And there is not. All right, so it's time to level. Slash warp tiki and boom. All right, so we're gonna level up the Archaeops. Whoa, hello, Umbreon. Oh, that's a wild Umbreon. I thought it was mine. Um, and then I mean, we got some level 60s, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Torterra's leveling up pretty quickly, so that's that's good. That's a bonus right there. I don't know where any chests are that besides the ones that I've went to so far. Um, let's hit the map here. Let's scroll out a little bit. Uh, pretty much covered most of where, where chests would be. Alright, so let's go on Archaeops. And fly! Fly me to victory! Alright, so we're gonna look for some bosses and some Mewtwo's to kill. Um, some Machamps to kill. Oh, oh, wait, wait. I think I already saw that one. I don't know why I said wait. Yeah, I did. Alright. Let's do that. Let's do what I just said. Um, gain some levels here. I don't... Ooh, a chest. Hello. I didn't even see that one. Come on. Give me a freaking Master Ball. Ha! Eight Pokeballs. That equals a Master Ball, right? <sighs> Frustrating. Frustrated sigh. Oh, that's a gigantic Onyx. Alright, let's... If we can't find Mewtwo's, we will kill Machamps. Imagine a boss Mewtwo. That would be freaking boss Mewtwo. Um, mm, nothing, nothing, nothing. Oh, there's a regular Mewtwo. This area is just, I, like, whoever, someone's definitely, I need to find a counter for Mewtwo. Because someone's going to have one. And it's going to, like, destroy everybody's faces. 
I've never been, like, not necessarily sick of, but, like, if I found a Mewtwo in another series, it would be, I, I wouldn't even be that excited because I know how difficult they are to catch now. <laughs> They're, like, impossible to catch. <laughs> so, okay, cool, he's paralyzed. Torterra. Alright. Shit. Um, Archaeops, don't kill my Archaeops, come on. Don't do it to me. Nice, he's just using Swift, so that's, that's a plus, I guess. Machamp, and Vaporeon I use at the end here for destruction. I hope he doesn't just destroy me, though. He could. Alright, cool. Muddy Water, come on, boy! Muddy Water him, cool. Confusion does a little bit of damage, but not, like, a crazy amount. Oh, Muddy Water is wrecking your face, bro. How do you feel about that, Mewtwo? Tell me. Ah, uh, Critical hit. I don't even mind that we g didn't get the other guy out because we just gained a lot of XP. Uh, let's go with Archaeops. I think I need to heal after that battle, though. That's the only thing that sucks. S All right, I gotta get it for my Pokemon. Slash Warp. TK. You know what? I'm not even gonna heal. What? Oh. I'm not even gonna heal. I'm just gonna go to the bed that's over not existent anymore. Oh, there it is. Is that an actual chest, or is that somebody's chest? I'm gonna check that chest after this. Alright. So, you guys all have seen the TMs. If not, you can obviously... Oh, these are more... Ricardo Open Bar. Not really. Seriously, don't take anything. Huh. Well, let's fly around, Mr. Archaeops. Find another Mewtwo. Get some more levels. Oh, oh, no. I thought there was a chest. Maybe I should go into the woods over here and look at the top of those trees, but... God, that just sounds so boring. Alright, let's look for a boss. I think a boss or a chest would be fine. Oh my gosh, another Mewtwo. Jesus. Alright, I'm just gonna... Keep on keeping on here with, with the whole Mewtwo vibe. Alright. Let's send out Agron and then Archaeops. Fight. Thunder Wave. I don't know if my Archaeops can, like, really learn anything that great, so we'll see, though. I got two Lucky Eggs, which is really, really good. Um, one on Torterra, and the other on... Who did I put the other one on? Oh, Machamp. Alright, so we'll put out Machamp. I think I can get my Machamp to maybe level 80, hopefully, or by the time we fight uh, the big fight. All right, let's um let's use Umbreon. Assurance, bro. I need that reassurance. Well, I just need the regular assurance, but you know what I mean. Dark, I think, is the most effective against him. It's super effective. Okay, so if I got my Umbreon up to like level whatever, it would do some serious, serious damage. Um, let's switch to Vaporeon and use whatever the hell it's called, Muddy Water. See, I don't even think I really lost like, any any HP. Oh, well, besides that, but I just, yeah, I just murked that Mewtwo without losing, like, nearly any, any, X, um, I mean, not XP, and losing any HP. That's pretty awesome. Archaeops, Torterra, Vaporeon, sweet. Okay, so that's just, like, levels in the freaking bag right there. I can't, I can't pass that up. This is a competition, guys. I gotta use these MLG Pro strats on these Mewtwo's and whatnot to make sure that I can still stay on top of everybody's uh, game. Oh, wait, maybe there's, oh my gosh, is that another Mewtwo? Jesus! This is, this is so okay with me. It's not even, I'm, I'm dead serious, like, this is really okay with me. Because this is just levels on levels on levels. And look, I'm not trying to catch them, so you guys aren't yelling at me, it's phenomenal. <laughs> Someone in the comment section is like, Stop hitting Mewtwo! No! You don't understand. It's a freaking level 80, so I get the most XP from it. Thunder Wave. Paralyze. Torterra. Oh, my Torterra is just going to be a beast. An absolute freaking beast. Um, Machamp. Let's see if Machamp does any damage to him. Let's low kick him. See if that does anything. Uh, it does some, not much. Alright, we'll switch to Archaeops. 
he learned to move at level 51, which is crazy. All right, now, Vaporeon. We'll get some muddy water on him, and then finally finish it off with uh, Umbreon. Oh, wow, that freaking murked his face. Vaporeon's getting stronger and stronger and stronger. It's phenomenal. And these Mewtwo's, like, don't have any moves that do damage, apparently. So it's phenomenal. All right, Assurance. I should save up money, and, I mean, I just don't, maybe maybe not even. I don't think it's worth the time to even save up money if I wanted to, um, sorry, my mic keeps sliding down. All right. I don't want to have it so that I, you know, have, spend all my time, you know, saving money. Bless you. Um, and not. Bless you. And not even be able to catch a Mewtwo with, ooh, Heavy Slam. User slams the target with its heavy body. The more the user outweighs the target, the greater its damage. Ooh, I bet you that's a lot of damage. Um, steel. All right, let's just use, yeah. So if I'm like, if I outweigh the crap out of them, let's actually see what a, what the, what that thing weighs. Summary. Weight. Stats. Weight. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, 306? Is that what this weight is? All right, let's see what um, this guy should be light. So he's, oh no, it says 567. Um, I don't see any weights. Move, growth, happiness, nature, speed, da, 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 da. Yeah, I don't see what our weight is even into play on that one. All right, but let's pull out the Archaeops again. Boom, bada boom, bada bing. Let's find a boss, bro. A big bo bo boss, bro. Oh, I thought that was Mewtwo. Mewtwo so far have been treating me very well in in my journey to try and destroy everybody. Um, but I wouldn't mind finding some super bosses, like a red boss or something. Even though they're going to be like level 100 or something like that, it would still be nice to try to find one and kill it because not only will I get items, but I can use it to... Um, Hopefully get some super epic uh, XP. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? No, I'm saying. No, I'm saying. All right, where are we going? Let's go this way, I guess. Looking for bosses, but at the same time, I'm not really. Ah, looking for chests more than anything. But I don't freaking see any. I don't see any bosses. I don't see any chests. Let's see if down here. I wonder if anyone's actually seen like a legendary, legendary, like a, you know, a real legendary, um, like a Moltres or a, anything like that. All right, so we're just gonna keep cr cruising around this area. So far, nothing. Um, tons of Vaporeon, Leafeon, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, but no, no bosses, no Mewtwo's, nada, not a thing, not a thing. Um, still, oh, you know what, let's go around to this tree area, see if we can't find ourselves a chest in this jungle of hell. We gotta look for the man-made trees, because that's where they're gonna be hiding. Oh, there's the man-made one. Oh, well, I just saw it, and then I lagged. Alright, there it is. Jeez, stop lagging, you jerk. Uh, eh? Oh, uh, yeah, I don't see anything. Oh, crap. Oh, don't die. Nope, okay, don't glitch out. Holy shnikes, I almost just died. That would have sucked. All right, I don't see where this chest was or is. Um, Should be over here somewhere. Yep, yeah, I give up on looking in the jungle. It's way easier to just track the chests that are not in the jungle. Especially, yeah definitely easier crazy easier all right here we go maybe maybe there's one more up here or in this tree in the jungle the mighty jungle ryan can't find anything at all all right let's no chests are you kidding me Ugh. why do you do this to me 
All right. Well, I guess that that's it. My time is pretty much expired for this episode. That sucks that we couldn't find more chests than we did. Holy Kangaskhan land. Um, but in the next episode, guys, we're going to be, hopefully the chests will be refilled. So we'll just swoop across all those main chests where we actually know where they are. And um, when we get back, we'll be doing some more training. We'll be, uh, uh, well, I'll probably be putting some TMs on people and I'm putting, I'll be putting together. Oh, is that? I hope that's a boss. <gasps> yes! Yes! Oh my god, this is going to be extremely difficult to kill though. Oh, shnikes. Oh, snap. I just hit F9 twice. Alright, that's not good. Hey, Ricardo. I just hit F9 uh, twice at the very end of this episode. So, uh, before I fight this boss, Numil. Alright. Just a heads up, man. I'll, I'll help you lose that fight. That's very rude. <laughs> oh my god, this is actually going to be a... Frickin' difficult. What's what's good against Numel? Um, what is Numel? I can't even remember. Um, I have no idea. No idea. Uh, oh, level one hundred and nine Numel. Oh, uh, that that's so high. What type is he? He is fire and ground. So if you wanna use a water Pokemon, you should. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, shnikes. You have a water Pokemon? Yeah, I have a Porygon. Oh god, I just hope he doesn't like just take me out like before I can even use any moves. Oh, it missed. You missed Muddy Water, you dumb idiot. Oh my Oh he one shot at him! Holy crap! Yeah. The same. Oh, oh. There you go. Oh my gosh, Impossible? okay. No. Man, you suck. Sandstorm, wild charge, more Did choice spectacles. Impossible? Did you? Yeah. Lucky. All right, well, that was a great way to, I guess, end it. I wish I could have got more guys out to fight, but wow, that Vaporeon just wrecked his face. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like. I will see you guys in the next episode. And, um, yeah, if you're new, make sure to subscribe. Right on, right on. Peace. Make sure to leave a like and hit that subscribe button.